Hello everyone, welcome back to Laser Penguin Games. Today we're going to be playing some Anvil beta test, play test, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. Um, <laughs> and I'm going to be showing you guys, I guess, the hub and we'll play through a level as well. You can see some actual gameplay as my last video was just explaining all the characters. So this is the main hub. I'm guessing they're going to be adding some stuff in on some of these empty bases, but um, this is basically where you pop out if you go to join multiplayer. We'll start over here. Uh, so this is upgrades where you spend a lot of your points to um, just get general uh, abilities for every character. Um, these stats will apply to every character, so you don't have to redo them and switch characters or anything. You always have them once you unlock them right now. And then you can pick up extra HP, damage, everything. All the good things make your character better. Here we have the toy worker station. Uh, this is where you can unlock like these little allies that give you extra buffs. Here I have a few unlocked. Bye. Uh, I'll probably be using Critical Soldier. He just helps with some crit damage and crit chance. And then we have the breakers where you're, you're going to choose your character. Um, when I started there was only three of them, two or three unlocked and then you ha I had to earn, earn the rest of them by playing the game and unlocking them. You can see the skills here. Um, the weapon they start with and this is where you also equip your relics which are uh, some really pretty, pretty strong buffs you you need to, to complete a lot of the game and then also they're gonna have some cool skins for each character which they don't have out yet coming soon uh, these are the relics I have unlocked so far uh, you can see there's different rarities um, the yellows being the legendary, and the purples being epic, and then there's just the blue commons. That's it for this station here. And over here we have the data station, and you can look at all the relics in the game. I guess it shows you can. Go by. You can see all the weapon types and what they do. And then if this shows each character's. So these are the upgrades you get when you're playing. They're not permanent upgrades, they're just unlocked as you play. Uh, and then they go away after your run. And you can get them again in the next run over and it just shows you all of them. What they do and go through them. them all and they, they tell you what they they all do. That's pretty much it for all the data. And we're gonna, gonna go play just the we're gonna try to do a single there's one star, two star, three star. Um it's weird it, it does kind of uh, get more difficult the higher star level but then at the same time um, you'll see here so you can play play one player or two player on the first map and then one or three players on the, the two star and then up to four players and then you can play solo but it's not not a good idea uh, to do it it goes way slower and most of the time you won't make it solo anyway um, but the first level here we are, we should be able to do it solo so we're gonna go ahead and queue up for a solo. You'll see here this this is only uh, five planets. Um, the two and the three star are all seven, seven planets of uh, either areas like this where you have to fight a lot of smaller mobs or there's boss um, ones as well. So you can see in the top left those are my starting relics that I already have and then you'll see when I buy smaller. So by killing enemies we're gonna earn currency and we're gonna be able to buy um, 
new relics for just this run. And then whatever you get during your run, at the end you have a chance to unlock one of the relics that you bought during the run. We're gonna... We're gonna pick up that. This is a health pickup. We have some very small health regen, but not a lot, so we're probably gonna have to find some. Let's see here. I'm just standing on this to activate. It should be an ally. Oh, that's a turret. And we'll just I'll shoot down all these guys. Let's take them all the aggro. First level, you don't have to worry too much. Oh, you'll see some new weapon drops there that we'll go take a look at. Um, you see in the top right, it says safe zone. Oh, freeze rifle, we'll try it out. So, in the 2 and 3 star, there's like an alert level, and you're basically being timed. I'm gonna buy King Diamonds and Penetrating Claw here. But, uh, if you take too long, the enemies get stronger and stronger and stronger the longer you take. So, you normally, once you get to this second and third star, which I guess I, I could play a, uh, a four star one after this. I'll check it out. Alright, we got another epic weapon here. There's a shotgun, which I don't really, don't really want it, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> See what we got in this box here. Oh, got some HP. Uh, we don't want the brawler's tooth. That's more for the melee and the close range characters. I'll we'll take the vampire module though, so we can get some heals off of that. Oh, we have a legendary weapon drop. You can see that it's glowing. Sniper rifle. We try it. Oh, I was like, what happened? Why did I get knocked down? Those little guys were jumping on me. We damage further from target. I only have so much, so. I want to see what stats this gives. So, attack speed. Jesus target. What does our sniper rifle give? Max HP, attack speed, ray shield on critical. Alright, you know what? Oh, we're gonna keep the legendary. And try it for a bit. Not really good for <laughs> for a lot of enemies, but That's some pretty good damage. But it uh, looks like we're gonna get swarmed pretty easily for using the sniper. Going back to the bridge here. If there's any upgrades in here. Our, oh, critical damage. Uh, debuffs. Let's see here, we're moving on to the next planet. Uh, we've cleared out all the mobs, so I think we're actually going to take that other rifle back because it's not really good for us to have the sniper actually um, because of our our attack speed buffs. Um, the sniper just is not. You have to charge it up, and it, it's kind of. Going against what uh, the character's trying to do here. Alright, anything we can get in here? Oh, attack speed buff. Nice. So we're not really doing a skill skill power build here. Uh, I think we're okay. There's going to be some more inside. Uh, we'll get the reload for dashing. Okay. We have like a boss here. We're gonna go ahead and blast them. See here, our attack speed is going crazy, and we just annihilated them. Uh, 
should be another box up here. We're gonna take critical shield. That's just another ability, which is okay, getting a ability cooldown too, but Three here. You see here on every level you get one of these boxes that gives you an ability upgrade to choose. Let's watch her upgrade. We have enough to get something. Oh, we already started with that, so we can't buy it. I don't really want any of those. So we're gonna pass up. Might be what we want. Won't be it. Let's see what it is. Yep, this is my favorite gun for this guy. It does a lot of damage. Lancer rifle. Only certain weapons will drop for each um, character. So if like uh, a melee weapon drops, uh, I won't be able to pick it up. Uh, but it will only drop when there's a melee character in the in the party, so I don't have to worry about it if I'm playing solo. I will, every weapon that drops will be usable. Uh, we'll take both of those, and I guess to go this way. Blocks off a lot of the areas when you're I'm going so well. Blue weapon. Uh, there's more enemies there. If I press, I'll probably kill them before I loot. <laughs> uh, it says there's eggs. Yeah, that might be the whole planet done. Where is it going to open up in their area for us? There? No. Oh, we got a new ramp open. We got a mini, it might be a mini boss or just a lot of mobs. There's all mini boss there, but we got annihilated pretty quickly. Alright, we'll buy this. <laughs> we have a shield up anyway, we didn't even take damage there. Look at this guy. Right, we got some max HP and some ammo regen, which will basically just help us uh, not have to reload it as, as much. We still have, you see the top left, the little orb at the top says 79, that's how much currency we have right now. So, most things will cost 30, 50, or once you get to the, the higher tier suit, um, you'll see some legendaries that cost 70. Um, in the first star, I think best we can see is the epics. In the second star, you can see some legendaries, but once you get to the third star, there's a lot more. Alright, so this is going to be. Those upgrades. And then. Yes. Uh, generate shield. Equal. That's what. I don't even think we're gonna have to dodge. I think we're gonna be okay. Rawr. Oh, we did dodge. We dodged. 
that we'll, we'll blast them with. No, <laughs> wasted. <laughs> Breaker gun. Is that a shotgun that fires? Oh, there's another. What happened? No. What's the, I don't even know what's attacking us. It might be a glitch. No, you know what? I don't really want. I just want to read the stats without being attacked. But apparently, it's glitched out, and it's not letting us really see. But I don't really want the. Oh, I did a crit. I guess there might be one more box to check, but I think we'll be okay. Alright, what else we got in here? Movement speed, you know, our defense. Or we'll take the recovery as well. Usually there's a few more boxes, so I'll reduce the cooldown. Ooh. Like this, we'll take the laser pine trap upgrade. But you'll see here we're gonna crit like crazy. I'll let him up, and then watch this, we're just gonna absolutely waste him. <laughs> and he froze us. He, oh, he's invincible now. We gotta wait. Just absolutely melt him with the laser rifle. Oh, invincible again. You only have so much time. Same with the rockets. There we go. I've been upgrading my weapon drop rate quite a bit so that I can see more weapon drops during the runs as well. But uh, that's a pretty, pretty good run. Those are all the upgrades, shows, and then we'll see if we unlock one. This shows you the skills you picked. Uh, usually I like to get this one upgrade here, and then if I can get all the other ones in acceleration module, that's what I usually try to pick. We'll go do a four player map as well. And we'll see how we do. A lot of times we can, we get wasted and <laughs> we might make it. You can see here I got points of VP, which I can go spend on the total workers or the upgrades when I want to, or also unlocking new characters as well. I have them all unlocked already. So we're going to go to a three star uh, four player and we're going to queue up. Now right now they don't have a friends um, list or friends invite which is really annoying we we're trying to play together so what you have to kind of do is queue at the same time and hope you get on the same team and then if you don't you have to like back out and try again so hopefully they'll fix that after the beta because um, uh, it can be annoying to uh, get put onto server not only do you get put on servers that you don't want to be so you get put on servers across the world which can lag um, but you get put with people because I think they have it right now too that it's set to um, open mic, which I turned off <laughs> because it was just getting so stupid people's mic spamming. Uh, mine's off too. You can see in the bottom here that people have their mics, but you can't you know, hear it. I'm going to check the box here, see what's in it. There's Ace of Spades, which I'll probably want. Um, ugh. Alright, so they started the boss, and we're gonna go fight him. So the three star, star levels is actually just all bosses, pretty much. You can see here we have none of our upgrades except for our starting relics, and I lost the gun as well, which is sad. We'll see if we can get something else here. Maybe it'll be a weapon drop. Oh, oh it looks like we got something. Now we gotta buy an upgrade, hopefully. Uh, we're actually going to take the damage reduction, so... Um, there was an attack power upgrade at the bottom, but for now, we have decent HP and some damage reduction. I guess I should ready up for the next planet, but it's counting down anyway. You can 
see here too. Um, you'll see the alert level going up on the right, and then when it hits uh, a full level, it's going to spawn. They'll spawn extra robots on us and make the bosses tougher. Ooh, these are both good. Well, I might come back to try and get those. Go ahead and blast this guy. So if you get lucky, you'll have a few characters um, that will stun certain bosses, although certain bosses are immune to certain stuns. Frozen. There's a good damage. Let's go check if there's a legendary. Uh, we're gonna go back and see if we can if we can get one of these. Um, we'll take. Pretty good. Not some of the I'll take. Looks like the back power. Looks like that guy's hurt pretty bad. The, um, the mountain, yeah. the mountain, an Uzi, and a toast. Usually, you know, start struggling between the fifth and the seventh boss. We have some candy there. I better get my upgrade before we start the boss. Uh, we're getting pretty unlucky with uh, the upgrades here. Do some damage before it becomes invincible. Ooh, that's a oh, he shot that right at me. How oh, rude! Yeah. Take some rockets, good sir. Bosses and level. I'm sure there's going to be all sorts of different uh, other kinds of levels when that game actually comes out, but this is what they have for the test. Invincible again. Invincible. Come on, boss. Stop being invincible, please. It's annoying because he's, he's increasing our alert level because he's, he's becoming invincible and we're trying to do damage. You can see in the bottom underneath um, as well that there's like a red bar. And if that gets to the end, the boss will enrage. Alright, I think we got him. Their weapon drop. Oh, there's a, there's a good one. Necklace of concentration. It's a hammer for the melee guy, or the um, the flamethrower guy can pick it up too. And we have, oh, we still have enough to buy something, but I think we'll wait for the next level. First, uh, I guess we'll take some HP. Ugh, awful. Fire one slow, large missile. Okay. Now we got too many bosses at the same time here. You see here, we're starting to have trouble. Get their HP down. Ooh, that hurts. Looks 
like we went down there, we got sucked into the blades, and we got three of us down, and... Wait, okay. Well, I got revived. I'm gonna revive somebody else, but you can see here on the bottom, bottom right corner there, in more near the middle, um, we only have a certain amount of respawns for the whole team, and we use most of them. And we don't have a healer. Uh, this is looking like it's gonna be a wipe. And everybody is dead. <laughs> we went, we died a lot quicker than I thought we would. That was only stage four. I'll see, I've... Uh, if you want to lock all your relic slots, you gotta beat all seven bosses. Um, in both, or so seven levels, in the two and three stars. So I've only done it on one character so far, which is liner here but it completely depends so anybody can queue for any map we'll try one more uh, they, don't, doesn't, they don't really check what you have unlocked or how strong your character is they can just everybody just goes in Unlock this higher chance for weapon drops again. If we found a team. And we can just ready up. So now we still don't have a healer, but we have a lot, looks like we have a lot of damage in our liner and Uzi and Julie. Okay. Uh, there we go. We got the ration module. Ooh, there's some. Ooh, there's some good stuff there. I'll we'll probably come back and get the attack speed. And this is the weapon drop. Team looks like they're a bit better. Is he going for the attack speed buff before I can get it? Yep. Oh, I'll take one of the suits. Uh, oh, my box kind of sucked anyway. Tell this team is definitely more geared than the last one. Uh, well, this box has not bad. We can make it in. I think we'll take a look at the other boxes first. Okay. Oh, something's hurting us real bad. Uh, we'll take the energy core. And let us activate our back our speed buff. Uh, we don't have a healer, but I have like some small auto auto heals, that's why I'm not gonna ready up for the next planet quicker too, because I'll regen some life at least. Any critical shield would have probably been a good idea. But I'm kinda going all damage right now. I this is the one armor I picked up. I need some heals. Ooh, it's an attack power buff right there. I already, had, I already started with it, so... Um, oh no, it's the, this boss. I'm gonna try to stay well outside his range. Oh, I think he might go down here. Not a lot of damage, but... 
Oh no. Oh. Yeah, I'm down. I would have dodged that, but if somebody comes to revive me or not, I'm just gonna stand in my circle. I think someone else is down there too. Did we kill the boss? everything again. Oh, I'll take critical shield this time. We still have enough to buy one more thing as well. Ooh, that's really... oh. What else but... We'll get the crappy candy then. Oh, we get crappy candy instead of legendary candy. But it still heals us <laughs> over time. I think our, our party is going to have some problems with toughness. We don't have any tank. Ooh. Ooh, some good stuff in this box. A lot of good stuff. Can't afford anything right now. I've got two mini bosses here. Wow, he just one shot me. Jumped on me and one shot me. <laughs> I don't think these guys can be frozen. Revive during the fight, so I don't know. Like they're going for the loot. Really? Oh, oh. Okay, it glitched out. Part of a, one of the glitches in the beta. Um, you can't revive your teammates. That sucks. Luckily, they, they <laughs> looked like they weren't even trying to revive me, but because uh, they weren't until the end there, till it would have been almost too late. But uh, I think the Uzi would have been would have been able to get me. That's a lot of players though in the beta, and they do that. That kind of sucked for a run, so we'll, we'll do one more and get a good one. Alright, we have a team that's not AFK. We got three DPS and some kind of tank. Some kind of mountain. Meow, meow, mountain. Although well, he's visiting all the stations. Ace of Spades there. Maybe that'll be good. Oh, down. Ooh. 
take the extended magazine here. Less reload is more damaging. Do I really need it now that we have a bonus? Probably not. I love this food. Gun dropped. Yeah, we already have that. If we want anything, I think maybe we just save it for the new, the new box. Usually I would take the necklace. Uh, uh, yeah, you know what, let's just take it. Let's just crit a lot. <laughs> gonna crit so much. No good to us. See what awesome three has here. Left and left and eat up most of that damage. Here and let him do this whole ice thing here, and then he's gonna go back to the center. And then uh, hopefully, not die here. All the way to the side. Why is that? Dodge him. Take damage. Oh, okay, there we go. Hopefully, critical shield's gonna help us a little bit. Pretty low on HP right now. Anybody have heals? We have some s ever so slight recovery. Let's check this box to see if it's got anything for us. Folks, I need some toughness. Yeah, that'll do it. It'll help at least. That's nice. Elevation module. Oh, some extra heals. Actually, get some heals before the fight. Very nice. Ooh, it's gonna be the double guy. Okay. I'm not gonna be able to freeze these guys. Let's dodge. Candy? Yeah. No, it's not for us. I have enough to buy something out of the new box. 
We're gonna take that uh, attack speed actually. Could help us deliver <laughs> the pain. <laughs> Hopefully there's a weapon drop for, for my class, but we'll see what happens. Uh, anything in here? Ooh, energy core. Okay, we're going to come back for that. See if we can pop a lot of cooldowns here and go crazy. We got one bar down. Some other guys on my team up. Oh wow, really? Can I play me like that? I'm invincible right now. Dang, that shield it looks nasty. We're gonna check this first and then we'll go back. Do us at the other box. Oh, we don't need it. Oh. We're gonna take the shield. And we should have enough to get uh, the energy core. Some extra heals here. Or two. Oh, two's dropping. Alright, we're on boss six here, I think. Got a pretty good team here. So, might be able to finish this. And get extra. Well, I guess burn. So, I guess we're gonna. We go crazy here on the boss. So, we're gonna. In a certain order here, we have to burn them and then unload everything here. Right, that one's down. Ah, we're down. Something just absolutely annihilated us. That looks like we took care of the other boss. Popped all my cooldowns and shredded that one guy. I have a decent amount of HP, but I don't even know. I guess I think we got hit by some uh, fire debuffs. Well, whatever we're getting is gonna have to be in the last box before the boss. I have two respawns left. I think I'm the, I, I'm the one who went down once. Uh, everything sold out. We are on boss number seven. Might make this one. No, no, let me have something. I don't want that. Never mind, I'll shop. <laughs> I'm gonna shop during the fight, I guess. Okay. I'm gonna try to go to the box and see what I can get. I guess I'll pop all my cooldowns though first. Do some mad damage. Doing a pretty good job at shredding them. Uh, we have a little over two now. I'll put out some robots. I'm just gonna blast them from afar here. I don't even think it's worth going after those. Then we have to fire everything. Get the whole box out. I don't want to get caught. I'm trying to get over it. There we go. We do have a, range, a pretty far range weapon here. So, alright, let's go ahead and pop all our cooldowns. We're gonna do some pretty good damage here from afar. And we're gonna stay inside the shield, hopefully. 
got a super big mag. <laughs> we're just gonna. We're not even having to dodge on these moves. I get some crit. Some mega crits. Yeah, we're doing some pretty heavy damage. Go ahead and blast them. At that speed again. Oh, we got a roll. Oh, okay. yeah, I'm going up top. And we're on this last bar. I can't even tell which direction it's rolling in. I'm down to half a bar now. I almost have my speed buff up again. Doing some major damage here. I would be doing a lot more if I had gotten a new weapon, but sometimes this happens and looks like some, one of the other guys got a decent weapon. I think we're going to make this. I think we, we shut him down here and we're going to complete the uh, three star, which is pretty nice. After a few fails, uh, it just depends what kind of team you get, if people have their upgrades or not, and if people can get some weapons. Uh, maybe we'll unlock a relic now too. We'll see if we can unlock a relic. We dealt some new ones here that I don't have. Ended up buying a lot. <laughs> we did not get a legendary though. Uh, these are all epic, but could be something decent. Get 2,835 BP. And we did. We unlocked. Oh, the crit necklace. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I might actually. Try that out. But it's a great unlock, and uh, a good good way to uh, finish this video. Uh, definitely excited to play this on release in September. Um, let me know what you guys think if you're gonna gonna try it out or play it in September. And uh, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Hello everyone who made it to the end of the video. This is Laser Pen Games, reminding you to smash that like button, leave a comment below, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It really helps out. And if you're looking for even more content, check out my Patreon here, where I post exclusive video content every month, and you'll have access to all of that.